Hello everyone and welcome back to Polybridge. Today we're starting on Desert Winds. There's another 12 levels here and there's another world after this. I have no idea how many worlds there are, but uh, I like how there's like camels here and like a satellite dish and a UFO. Um, I'm assuming after this point they're gonna start getting really hard to do, okay? I'm, I'm kind of terrified to see what kind of stuff we're gonna have to do in the future. 12 meter low budget bridge, so I guess we just gotta be really bare with it. That should be pretty easy, right? Just, th this should be just throw a few things across, stick some wood in between, and we'll have a bridge. There, look at that. It's beautiful. It's gonna work. It's perfect. Boom. Oh, that's not looking good. That is not- be careful, school bus! Okay. I've only spent 3,000 bucks. I got so much more money I could spend, I assume. Oh, no, 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 wrong button, wrong button. I don't want to send you guys into uh, into the water again. I mean, I kind of do, but I don't at the same time. Hold on a second. We just got to go over here, this, all the way to the end, and then you can stick them on. There you go. This is going to be fine. Okay, so this, uh, this isn't good. I'm over budget. Wait, though. Wait one second. We can delete stuff here. So what if we just delete the inside part and then add that there? Okay, now we are uh, 700 bucks under budget. I guess this is going to work. I'm not really sure. But uh, considering, you know, it's got supports on one side and then in the middle and then on the other side, I think it's going to work. Shift. Oh, it's buckling. It is buckling real bad in the middle. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. We need to put uh, that there. Perfect. And now we're still under budget by 400 bucks. Oh, yeah. That bridge is looking great. Look at it. Mmm. Okay. Boom! That was nothing. I, I I think this is gonna be pretty easy. I bet you the next one's gonna be super hard. Double decker! Okay. 16 meter double decker. So something has to go across the top and the bottom. We have cables for this. I don't know how that's gonna help, but but we got them. Shit. So I guess the first thing we should do is put roads on each, right? That that would make sense. Put roads on each of these and then see what happens, right? Oh, hang on a second. This won't be that bad. You, they said we got cables. Oh, no, no, no. Don't start yet. What the hell would that do? Nothing. It's just all gonna break. Okay, we got uh, steel beams, and we got wood, and we got cables. We got how many? Unlimited cables. Wow, okay. So I'm thinking in that case, we can probably just put the wood on top and then put the cables to suspend for the rest of it, and it should work. We have a huge budget for this. Will this work right here? No, it won't. Okay. What if we put some steel beams on uh, on this here? Like, no, oh, you're not going to reach. I hate you. Put the steel beams here and here. And then, yeah, the bridge actually stays up on top. And now we can just uh, use cables to do the rest, right? Just put cables here like this um, from each one. I feel like it's not going to work. But I'm going to do it. Put the cables there like that and see what happens. And go. Oh, you see that strain? That could mean something. Ah, oh, it means something. Okay. How are we going to fix this? Oh, there's a thing here. Can we use this for something? Can we put a cable from there to there? Uh, this seems really stupid, but it might work, right? No, because the top the top is the problem here. Though, though this will... Yep, yeah, I was going to say, it's going to prevent some of the, the car under it from pulling on the top one. It worked, and we're under budget by $10,000. I could have uh, I could have did something more with that, but... I mean, why do more when you don't have to? 99.1% joint stress. I like pushing it to the limit, man. Just push that shit to the limit. Okay. So we got a drawbridge situation here, guys. I know that um, there are some cool ways you can do drawbridges where you lift the entire bridge, but I don't know if we're gonna be able to do it this time. Like I saw, I saw a um, a little video someone sent me in the comments, and they took the whole bridge in one of the levels, and they just went whoop, and the bridge went up and it lay back down again, and everything was fine. But uh, I have a feeling that uh, if I do that, something bad is gonna happen. Hmm. Okay, $29,000 to make this bridge. I feel like we need to use, like, not very many resources. But $29,000 is a lot of money. But I don't have any, like, um... I don't have anything to, to really hold it up with, right? I mean, hold on a second. Wood. Road. Hydraulics. There's nothing here. How do you... Oh, hang on. We're gonna have to bring stuff across, right? Oh, we'll build it above. Yeah, we'll build it above. No. Yeah? Maybe? Because if we do this, we might actually be able to, uh... You know, do something with it. I don't know, man. Okay, I just want to preface this by saying that I have no idea what I'm doing here. But the bridge does stay up, okay? The car crosses underneath it. It almost breaks, but it don't break. Okay, see? That's perfect. It dropped right right under it. Oh, God. Okay, now what? Can't, uh, can't hydraulics, like, um, move things out or in? So maybe I can do something with that? I don't know, man. I didn't really like the station wagon guy anyway. He was a prick. <laughs> So, so just, just hang on a second now. So this lifts up now, right? Up above the, uh, not even close. 
Okay, thank you for breaking. I still don't know what I'm doing, but I'm trying other things, okay? What if we had hydraulics that reached down and just pulled the entire bridge up? How many hydraulics do we have? Four. No, unlimited. The hockey is four. So, yeah, what if we just did that? What if we went down like, like this, okay? Went down here and then added another one, right? That ought to do it, and then it could just pull right up. But you need to put some in the middle as well. So, like, here and here. And then, and then here and here. I mean, it's perfect, right? It's perfect. It's gonna lift up. Everything's gonna be fine. It's gonna go back down again, and nobody is gonna die. Oh shit! What the hell was that? The entire bridge just disappeared. <laughs> oh, it's not a split joint. We gotta split it. Sorry. Ah, oh, it's so beautiful. It lifts right up. Huh. I can't believe I actually got that to work. It touches the top. The chimney on the. Uh, and the boat touches the top, but nothing really happens. And now it's gonna low back, lower back down. And the station wagon's gonna go across. I'm actually really proud of this bridge. I thought this was gonna be crazy. Think you can fool me with your, oh my God, what? 42 meter suspension bridge. Okay, I kind of wanted to do this because I kind of wanted to try a suspension bridge, but now I'm kind of worried because that's really long. Okay, how do we, uh, how do we do this again? There's the thing on top and there's another thing on top and we also gotta break it in the middle. Okay, I don't know how these work. We got cables. We got steel beams. We got suspension. So the suspension goes from one to the other, right? Yeah, okay. So that's gotta go over here. Let me just zoom out here so we can actually see everything. There we go. And add suspension, right? There you go. Okay. So the question now is how the hell are we gonna do the middle? Oh, oh, I know what we gotta do. Undo that. We have to, uh, we have to put a steel beam here. Steel beam goes up like this. There you go. Oh, try again. There you go. Good steel beam. Another one goes up like that. Okay, and now we put the suspension across. Because we gotta make sure there's uh, enough uh, space up top here so that the boat can go through. I don't know what kind of boat it is this time, but uh, let me just see. So now we go with suspension. That goes all the way across. Boom. And that ain't good. That, that ain't very good. Because now the boat is still gonna hit it. Or will it? It might not actually. I don't know. I don't know how this stuff works. So far, so good. I think everything's gonna be, need to be uh, attached together for this. I think that might help. I think I've reached a point in this game where I'm just, I'm not good anymore at what I do. I never was that good at what I do, but now it's like, man, what you doing? Okay, what, what is happening? I don't know what the bridge is doing. I don't know how to build this bridge, but I'm trying. It's just like, I don't, I don't know, touch things there and then you guys can touch each other and you can't touch each other because you're too far away and everything breaks. What I'm gonna do, instead of trying to do suspension, is I'm just gonna try and build it just like this, okay? And I realize that steel beams are probably what you need for this. You need to put some steel beams there because um, you don't want the jet fuel to melt them, okay? So uh, yeah, we're just gonna stick some steel beams here like that, and that's gonna make things a lot more sturdy. But obviously, if one side is having problems, the other side is going to, uh, you know, not do so well. So if we stick all these beams in here, I think we should probably have a thing that works. Look at it, it's perfect. As long as the uh, the vehicle can get, uh, get uh, over the top now without breaking anything. Hold up, guys. Don't go too fast here now. Okay. It's dangerous territory. We're fine. We're fine. I didn't know how to do a suspension bridge properly, so I just didn't do one at all. <laughs> that That's that's called problem solving right there, guys. Oh, okay. What is this? New feature unlocked. You can now choose to build your bridge without the grid. Oh, okay. This gives you more precise control over the position of your joints while also allowing you to optimize and keep budget to a minimum. Beware, building without the grid makes it harder to maintain symmetry, an important aspect in most load-bearing structures. Most of them, okay? That's important, because maybe ours are okay. This is a 14 meter double jump. So two people are jumping across. So you... What? Are they gonna hit each other? Let's just see what happens. How do they do it? Okay, they do it at the same time. That's pretty cool, actually. I'm not gonna lie. I, I think that's pretty cool. So we just need to make a little jump for them. That should be pretty easy if you if, if you ask me. Because we just need road, wood, and there's some cables here. Okay, so if you just stick some road up like this. Um, maybe even like that, right there. So try and get the same thing going on the other side. So same to you. Looks like it might be the same to me. And now we just got to... Uh, I'd say attach a cable right here, because cables are pretty long, right? There you go. Cable. And then, uh, then just attach some wood to make it nice and sturdy. Are these good? 
Yeah, these are pretty good. Watch this. Oh, nope. Why did one of them give out and the other one not? Is something different between them? I thought they were exactly the same. This is fine, right? This is fine. Everything's touching. We're good. And the car's hitting. How is it? How am I supposed to fit? <laughs> if the cars are hitting each other, how do I fix that problem? My brain is completely filled with fuck at the moment, and I don't know what to do about this. How do you get a double jump? I like the way the cars hit them, hit each other in the air, but I don't know how I'd actually make a double jump where they don't do that. Hmm. Let me let me just watch this one more time. Not not just because I like seeing the cars hit, but because I want to know what I can do differently. I guess they have one has to uh, be at a slightly different angle than the other. Like if that one did that, they'd be on a different angle. One would go over the other one, right? Yeah, and now the only problem is they're not going fast enough? Oh, oh, are you kidding me? I'm out of money now? So I can't do this. What if we take off the, uh, the suspension? I'm so confused. Let's just delete everything. We're gonna, we gotta start over, guys, cause, cause we're out of money. We are currently over budget by a few bucks, and the cars are hitting each other directly on their fronts. So this isn't good. I still don't know how to get past this part. But I, I did manage to make something that's a bit more economical here. Economical, something economical. How do I fix this? Oh, we'll move it in a little bit. Hold on, no, don't touch that. Move it in. There, now we're under budget. Now, if only we could get the cars to actually go across properly. Come on, cars, you can do it. That's not how you do it. We'll fiddle with it until we get it just right. That car got over it. That car got over that time. Okay, good. So what if we just uh, move things to down a little bit? There you go, move that down like this and then just 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 fiddle okay look at how close it is right now this is beautiful so freaking close that that car made it and didn't even fall down and like do anything crazy this time so how do we get it a little bit better this Maybe like that oh come on car we are very close to something here guys watch this oh okay it doesn't look that close at all but I swear it is all you got to do is get uh, one of the cars to go up a little bit more than the other, but I don't know. I guess if we just made this one slightly different, it might work. Okay, make it slightly different. Uh, bring this down here and this down here, and we're over budget by such a small amount. There, fixed it. Watch this. This is it. It's probably not it. Ah! Oh! Move you there. Don't be over budget, man. It's not cool being over budget. Bring everything down. Make it smaller. Smaller is better. In almost nothing. Ah, that car it just it wants to do it what's more important saving money or saving lives I've often asked myself that question and I can't figure it out cuz damn it I just want this bridge to work come on buddy you got this you got this you got this you fell you died you're dead why could this be it could this do it oh, 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 did you see that that was beautiful what if we just brought this down a little bit here Keep the same angle, hopefully, but just bring it down. That is it. Come on. Ah, oh, you guys hit. Oh, shit. Okay, try that again. Do it. Do it. Do it. Shit. Shit. Every time I make a small adjustment so that one of them gets across, the other one doesn't. Oh! Oh, that's it. That's the one right there, guys. We just need to make sure it's a little bit more sturdy, I guess. Can we... No, I don't want to make any more cables. I just want to make some more wood, you son of a bitch. Go. That's not gonna hold. That is not gonna hold. It's gonna be terrible. Ah! Okay. Okay, this is not good. Can we certify it on bottom? Certify, it's a word, okay. It's a, it's a certified word. Is that helping? Is it like lodging against the, the thingy? Come on, don't fall down. I got this. It's in the bag. Look at it, look at this bag. You see this metaphorical bag? It is in there. Wait, wait. They just told me that you can turn off the grid now. I'm going off the grid, guys. But boom I'm off the grid. Okay. This will allow us to make fine adjustments until it works. Why didn't I think of that? That's what we need to do here. Okay, that wasn't a good fine adjustment. Can we just move back a little bit? Like there? This is the closest we got, right? Closest here. Did you see that? Did you see that right there? Oh, it's so perfect. I moved it down a little bit. I moved it down a little bit. And the cars touch. Move it up a little bit. And then the cars don't touch, but they also don't make it. <gasps> Son of a bitch! Do you see the car? The way the car just wanted to do it? This is it. This is it right here. I can feel it in my bones. Oh, man! Really? That thing actually made it over there that time. Come on. There. 
A little, that was the tiniest adjustment in the world, okay? Like, fractions of a- fuck! Fractions of a fuck! Okay, okay, I think we got it now. I think we got something that's pretty much perfect. I'm just gonna move this around on the side and see if I can stop it from breaking. Oh, man! Okay, don't break, guys. Remember, to, we're here to not break. I, I don't really know what the problem is here, but if you could just not. If you could just not, even in the slightest, that would be great. I think I just screwed something up entirely. Let's see. Nope. Car! Car! Go! 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 Car! Car! What if we move it, like, micromillimeters, just to see what happens here? Because that was cool. What? Ah! Oh, you can't land. You can't land there like that. You, ha you, have to, you have to go the other way. There. Everything is now screwed up again, I bet you. Yep. It worked! It worked! We gotta, we gotta play that one again. Oh my god, I've been sitting here just trying again and again and again with so many different things. And I could not get it to work, but we got it. Just watch this one right here. Just watch it. Yeah, I bet it's gonna be different this time. Ugh! That is so freaking close to not working. Max joint stress, 113.2%. Let's just move on real quick and see what else is there. If it's an easy one, we might be able to do it. It's a double drawbridge, 16 meter, with two surfer vans and two small tugboats. I don't think that sounds easy at all, guys. And after how long I spent trying to do the other one, I think I'm going to end this video here, and then we'll work on the double drawbridge next time, because I think that one's going to be a bit of a doozy. They're all getting really hard now, okay? I'm, uh, I'm going to be at the point now where you guys are just going to cringe at whatever I do, because obviously... I'm not going to know how to do all these right away, and there's going to be a lot of trial and error involved. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.